Here's how to create a GIF in CapCut. Now, if you're in CapCut on your phone and you wanted a specific video to play over and over and over again in an endless loop, I'll show you how to do that. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks, guys. Now, let's open up the CapCut app here, and I'm just gonna create a new project. So tap on New Project here. And I'm gonna scroll down and find, let's say, this four second clip and hit Add. Now, you'll be able to see it basically plays, and then at the end, it has this random cap cut end screen. So I'm gonna tap on that and hit delete. So I don't want that in the GIF. And you'll be able to see here it plays, but it doesn't play in a loop like it normally would for a GIF. However, I can convert it by tapping on at the top right where it says 720p. And then now you'll see at the very top left is the GIF icon. I can tap on that. And now keep in mind, there are some downsides to this. Basically the uh, 240p, which is a fairly low resolution is free. I can tap on export and show you what it looks like. Let's open up the photos app and you'll be able to see it does work. It does create a GIF that endlessly loops, but again, it's pretty grainy. So if I go back here and I wanted to do 640p, unfortunately I have to tap on Pro here and I have to hit Join CapCut Pro. You can see one year is $110, one month is $12. So essentially you could always pay for this for a month and then cancel it after you're done creating those gifts. Or if that's a feature that you really like, you can always pay for it and then get that really high resolution option. Keep in mind, there are some online versions as well. So you can always just open up a web browser here and you can type in video to GIF converter. And there are a number of different options, basically uploading that video. As long as it's fairly short, you can upload that video to any of these websites and it will automatically do that process for free. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks, guys.